Hey everyone, Tim Schofield here from cubicking77.com here to do a video showing you how you can root your LG G2 while on Android 5.0 Lollipop. So what we're gonna need to do is on your device actually enable USB debugging. So scroll down, go to about phone, and then go ahead and go to software info and then quickly tap on build number about seven times until it says you are a developer down at the bottom. Then go ahead and go back twice and then you should see developer options within settings. Go ahead and make sure USB debugging is checked. You'll see mine's already checked, so check it, hit OK, and then we're good to go. Now the next step is to download the, and install the LG drivers on your computer. I'll link every, all the downloads in the description. So make sure you install those if you have not. And then also go ahead and download the LG one-click root script by Avico. So shout out to him. And once you've done that and you have the drivers installed in your PC, you can actually just plug your device into your computer. I recommend leaving the screen on during the script process just because you might have to check allow on a certain box. So just leave the screen on and let's go ahead and go over to our PC. Okay, so you'll see I have this one click root script downloaded. I already downloaded the drivers as well. So what you're gonna wanna do is just double click on it. It's gonna be an EXE self extracting archive. I'm gonna throw it on the desktop and I'm just gonna hit okay and I'm gonna hit extract. And then what's gonna happen is it's going to download this, I mean extract this one-click root MSI application here. So we're gonna double click on that and it says, welcome to LG one-click root setup wizard. Hit next. Um, it's gonna install it. I'm gonna go ahead and hit install, hit yes. And you'll say launch LG one-click root and hit finish and then it's gonna actually open up the application that we just installed. So now we're ready to go. I'm just gonna hit start. It's gonna say starting ADB server on your device. You might wanna watch it. There might be an option to allow it uh, certain options. So click allow if a certain screen pops up. It didn't for me, I might have already done it. But you'll see it'll reboot our device. It says looking for LG serial port. This was very simple. Again, USB debugging needed to be enabled. If for any reason your device doesn't get recognized, you might want to switch from MTP to PTP. You can try a different USB cable. You can try a different USB port. And then also, if, you, if all else fails, you can also try uh, the script version download, which will be in the link in the description. So you can try that one as well. If you need a tutorial for the script version, I'll link my LG G3 root video that uses that script. All right, so it looks like it's rebooted now. I'm gonna unlock it and then we're gonna see what happens. It looks like it still says, looking for LG serial port at 45%. Um, I believe LG serial port means um, download mode. Yeah, so you'll see serial port not found. Please insert the phone manually into download mode. Disconnect the USB cable, turn off the phone, press and hold volume up. So we're gonna need to manually put this into download mode and plug it in. No big deal. Let's just go ahead and power off the device. All right, once the device is fully powered off, press and hold the volume up button. Press and hold it while you plug in the device into our computer. So just go ahead and press and hold it. And you'll see it says download mode. Yours might've automatically gone into download mode. If it did, great. You don't need to do that step, but you'll see my needed to do it. So there we go, plugged it back in. Now it says rooting the phone. It's at 90%. And it says done. So there we go, it should automatically reboot our device. And it is, and that should be it. Honestly, we should be fully rooted. I'm gonna let this boot up. It might take a little bit longer than usual to boot up, it might not. I'll let you know. All right, so the phone booted back up. Pretty standard boot time. We're done with our computer, so you don't need to plug the, you can unplug the device if you want to. You see, all done. And then within this uh, app drawer, you should actually see an app called Super SU. There it is, right down there. Awesome, that doesn't mean we're necessarily rooted though. So let's go ahead and go to Root Checker Basic. And, which I got from the Play Store, and I'm just gonna hit verify root, and it's gonna pop up a super user request. You can allow it, you can deny it, but basically if this pops up, it just shows that we are actually rooted. All right, there it goes. Took a little while, but it popped up. Super user request, grant, and we are now fully rooted on the LG G2 running Android 5.0 Lollipop. Hope this video helped you out. If it did, give it a thumbs up. If you could subscribe to me as well, I'd really appreciate it. You can follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Google+, all links in the description of the video below. If you have any questions, feel free to ask, just leave a comment. And as always, guys, thank you very much for watching.